I think it's a mistake for people with borderline personality disorder to th believe that they can't get better unless they see somebody who's been trained to treat borderline patients and where they stay in a sustained and intensive treatment over a long period of time. The majority of borderline patients get better and never see anybody who has had any specific or uh, training in borderline personality disorder. It doesn't mean that treatment hasn't had an important effect on them, but it helps them get out of stressful situations, helps them find less stressful situations, helps them by being sort of a stable place that you can ventilate or get Dutch uncle counseling into running their life better. And that is the modal treatment that is successful for the vast majority of borderline patients. I'm less concerned about the unavailability of DBT or metallization-based treatment or transference-focused psychotherapy than I am the unavailability of people who are interested in giving them support and good advice and good sense and not doing bad things with medications or otherwise. I think that's something that we can improve on greatly. And the patients who don't get better from that are the ones who should then subscribe to something like DBT or MBT or TFP and with a longer term commitment and where the treaters need special training and expertise.